Ah, oh, hello. It is Thursday at quarter to one. Uh, I haven't washed my hair. I feel a real scruff. I got up late. Uh, Alfie had me awake at five this morning. So I was awake for like a couple of hours, went back to bed for an hour and got up late. So I didn't have time to shower before coming to the shop to wash my hair, basically. So I'm trying to figure out this Shopify theme at the moment. So it's now quarter to three and I'm feeling a little bit like out of sorts. I wouldn't say fed up, I'm just a bit out of sorts really. Um, I, I don't know, I think the Shopify theme thing's just got me down again and it's, ah. Uh, basically, uh, if you don't know the story, um, I paid for someone to redesign my Shopify website all looked pretty beautiful etc and they used a theme for it you have to use themes which is basically a design layout anyway I get an email from Shopify that says you're using an unlicensed theme so you need to either pay for the theme or change the theme to a different one so I'm like right brilliant so I spoke to the person who did it and they accused me of telling Shopify or emailing Shopify like it was my fault what I didn't email Shopify about anything they just contacted me and said we can see that you're using an unlicensed theme so I'm at the point now where I have a deadline coming uh, they're gonna it says in the email that they're going to report my theme for being unlicensed to the original um, theme designers for copyright infringement or something like that if I don't get a license by the 12th of December so I tried to pay for it today seven times and it wouldn't go through tried with the PayPal account no tried with my normal account no and I have the money the money is there but I'm now at a point where I'm so frustrated with it I've had to just turn it off now, I don't want to pay £300 for a theme, but this guy on Fiverr has put me in this position, so I either have to pay £300 for the theme, if I can get it to go through, which means I'm going to have to contact Shopify again, I've already spoken to them twice today, and say, look, it's not working, can you fix it for me? Or, organise a free theme, which takes... It's going to take me ages to redesign the front page. I'd got the front page just as I like it, um, but if I want to do a free one, I'm going to have to readjust all of the bits at the side. So it's like, do I spend a day, two days redesigning the whole thing for a free theme, or do I pay £300? I think it's like $380, works at about £300 for the paid one. So I've just had to step away because it's just doing my head in. Uh, I figured out how to do uh, a few more reels though on my Instagram so I've put one on today and I'm going to get into that a little bit more really want to promote the shop through Instagram a bit more if I can and I've learned how to boost the posts so it will be advertised now so that's done that's a good thing um, but I don't know it's frustrating me I've had people in the shop today no one's bought anything from about one o'clock onwards it's been dead there's been nobody in just raining constantly the weather's been so appalling this winter no one wants to come in and come out because it's just freezing and raining all the time so no one wants to come out of the houses which i get and if they do come out they want to go to a nice warm shopping center they don't want to go to like the local high street where it's freezing and raining <sighs> now my online business are going fine it's going great but the shop not so much um so i'm doing promotion to try and get people in all of that um, but my head's just gone I think my head's gone the Shopify things just melted my brain <sighs> it is Thursday though so Simon might be home tonight that'd be nice uh, tomorrow I'm gonna have to go for the blood test so I've arranged for Liz to come and open the shop while I go for the blood test and then we'll swap over um, and then tomorrow night is a night off and then some readings on Saturday but tonight I've got a singing lesson and some readings as well um, but I'm just feeling a bit of a mess. I'm feeling a bit cold for one. It's freezing. I didn't have time to wash my hair. I just feel blah. I've actually been sat here like this with a heater pretty much in between both knees 
trying to keep myself warm. <sighs> Such is life. Okay, I need to take some time away from the screen, step away from the screen, and just, yeah, maybe I need a cup of tea. Now, a cup of art could fix everything, couldn't it? Look at state of me. Yeah, a cup of art. Alfie seems happy enough. He's sat in his little bed, all snuggled up. Um, although I can't be bothered to get up. <laughs> it's that cold, you're like... Ugh. And then it'll mean I need a wee And it means I have to go out in the cold To the outside toilet for a wee <laughs> But I did a pendulum the other night I don't think I mentioned it on my last vlog uh, I did a pendulum as part of my Crystal Live uh, Tuesday night, right at the very end Somebody said I've got a question I went, hang on, let me get a pendulum uh, so they didn't know what to ask it so I asked it a question I said will I be moving shops next year it said yes and I said in the first part of the year no in the sort of from July onwards it said yes so it looks like I will be moving shop but I think it's going to be a while so I'm going to have to make the best of what I have right now so either that I'll just pull out altogether but no I can't do that I've, I've got even if I do come out of the shop I've got three months to go through so I don't I just think if the weather was better, that might help. And I have been promoting a lot in the area, so people have been coming in. I'm just in a, just ignore the rambling here. I'm just out of sorts. I'm tired still, even though I did have a lot of sleep last night. Ugh, moan over. Well, I'm home and I'm feeling a little bit better in my head now. Mentally, I feel a little bit fresher, I think because I just couldn't get past the fact that I'd been screwed over you know somebody had just you know ripped me off basically told me that they were giving me something for free and it wasn't uh, I just couldn't move forward from it I couldn't move forward and choosing to either pay £300 or go with the free route was just doing my head in I've been putting it off for about a month I'm not putting it off but I'm not addressing it so I had a faff, out, faff about with it after I uh, chatted to you last and I figured it out I don't need the expensive theme a free one is more than adequate I just need to make sure it looks as I want it to look and that is possible now I've been playing around with it it's totally possible so I'm going to go the free route I'm going to delete the old one once it's all updated to the new one and <clears throat> to that guy for screwing me over but there we go uh, so I'm feeling slightly fresher my head's fresher I was also stressing out because I, I thought I was late putting the bin out and I forgot last time I thought I'm going to get home and there's going to be a full bin at the end of the driveway it's very annoying and I've, I'm already <laughs> missed one so I'm going to have to find a way of getting rid of the rubbish anyway it's emptied yeah so I must have heard like the garden bin this morning because um, I definitely heard a dustbin van but it turns out it must have been the garden bin because it's empty yes so that saves me a job so now i'm making myself a cup of tea before i go and teach i'm completely soaked through because i've been wandering in and out with wheelie bins and sorting out recycling and stuff um but i feel fresher and i know i keep saying to myself focus on the psychic readings the crystals and everything else will come along with it but am i doing that no i've not made that switch to do that um there's too much in my head that's just like in boxes that I'm not thinking clearly head so I'm gonna step away from it well I'm not because I'm teaching and then I'm doing readings but then when I'm in tomorrow I'm gonna to go right take some oracle cards with me do some readings on TikTok and then show people around the shop two for one better option and I've got to have a blood test tomorrow so I've got to go and do that first in thing in the morning and I've got to go and drop off the post but I've discovered that they will collect your post for free now there are some that are Etsy which I do on Etsy and not on the Royal Mail website so I don't know if they're going to collect everything or if they're just going to collect 
the stuff that I've done on the Rail Whale website. It depends if they're going to be shirty with me like they were last time. There was a jobs with lady who didn't want to take more than five that weren't on the list or something. Um, but that would help me a hell of a lot if they come, because they drop the post off in the morning. They could just take stuff away with them. Because I think most biz big businesses would do that anyway. So I'm going to do a test I've got one as collection tomorrow. Uh, and I'm going to ask them, how many more do you take that are not listed for collection that are like on Etsy or a different thing, but they're still Royal Mail, but not done on the Royal Mail website. Royal Mail, Royal Mail website. And we'll go from there. Right, I'm going to best make my tea and then get organised for for this singing lesson. So I've done my singing lesson with Freya, she did really well, let's get the light on. Uh, we're working on a river Christmas song, she's got into a school performance thing uh, and she's been working on the song River. I then did two readings, went very well, it was supposed to be three but one of them had an internet connection so I'm going to do a reading from a photograph instead and uh, yeah both readings went fantastically well very pleased with them now I need food it's about quarter to eight and I've not eaten yet is it quarter to it can't be quarter it is it's quarter to eight and I've not eaten a tea yet uh, Simon's stuck coming home from Slough so God knows what time he's going to get back uh, but I need food and I have no idea what to have I've been kind of busy so I've not really done any shopping <sighs> there's garlic bread in the fridge and bacon. Is that it? <laughs> Is that my choices? Oh, there's halloumi up there. <sighs> Tilly wants something. <laughs> Can you hear her? Oh, and I did something last night. There's a website for Invisalign and you can do like a selfie. <laughs> <laughs> to see what your teeth would look like straightened oh my god it made me not want to have Invisalign because I've kind of put it on hold I uh, just don't want to spend £3,000 on having my teeth straightened when they're healthy they're just a little bit wonky I could do with them slightly whiter they're naturally a slightly off white sometimes yellowy looking so I work hard to, to get that uh, as white as I can but um, should we find out what she's after? What is it? She doesn't like hugs so I can't hug her but maybe she wants a bit of a scratch behind her ear. Oh so I've had uh, poached eggs on toast. I know that's a very unusual dinner but there was a lack of food in my house today. Because I've been so busy I've not had time to do any shopping so that's what I had. It was quite nice, I enjoyed it. Um, I've just realised I've stopped halfway up the stairs. Um, so I'm going to sign off for today but my evening was great. I really had a nice evening. I got myself stressed out at the shop that I didn't need to get stressed out about. But I'm going to finish the website for a free theme. Woohoo! which will update regularly whereas the one I have at the moment it doesn't update regularly it just stays the same so there'll be new options coming out every so often which I'm very pleased about so tomorrow I've got to get up early uh, I'm doing a blood test uh, and some other stuff and then going over to the shop uh, I've just been watching a little bit of MasterChef actually this huge dome almost like the sphere in Las Vegas and they were making all of these thought-provoking kind of meals including a chicken's leg with the foot on and they take the chicken off and then they fill the skin with something I'm not sure what it was there was it was supposed to be thought-provoking on eating animals because they put the chicken leg then in a cage I was like god yeah I'm not gonna be eating that <sighs> definitely not anyway I'm gonna sign off and uh, I will be back tomorrow. Hopefully I will be slightly more focused tomorrow. Not let my head get mashed. Um, but it's Friday so, you know. Oh, I'm very blue. Uh, Fridays are always a good day. Uh, so, let me just get out of the blue. There we are. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying my vlogs. Um, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye, loves. Whoa, oh, oh. Da, 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 da. Da-da-da-da, oh-oh, da-da-da-da, making a crazy
Christmas memories. 